the library early on recognized that it was important to collect items of popular culture, and these would extend beyond the realm of books and include pulp novels, baseball cards, posters, pamphlets, comic books, and Japanese comics of the 1920s. Graphic novels offer readers a very rich and rewarding experience where you're able to experience something that is visually compelling and rich in language. There's always that stereotype that teenagers are not readers, that they don't care about books, but when you walk into the teen section of a library, that's actually where you're, you'll find the most reading. I come to the library every day, any chance that I get. I go to the library so I can use the internet, meet my friends there, read manga. Manga, technically, is a Japanese word that simply means comic. It's just action the whole time. After School Nightmare is um, one really great example of a manga. It tells the story of a character who is half boy, half girl. It actually is a story that explores identity, who you are as a person, and how sometimes your outside is not the same as what's inside of you, and how you can kind of reconcile the two. Graphic novels deal with the concerns of the day. For example, Birth of the Nation speaks about the role of individuals in a community and their relationship with government. Hoche Anderson's King is a really wonderful example of a graphic novel that explores incredibly complex issues and looks at a time in history that a lot of people think they're very familiar with, but when you read something like King, it's a much more immediate experience than just reading it as text on a page. The images come alive for you as a reader. In building our graphic novel collections, we look for materials that celebrate Latino and African American experience, that talk about issues of identity and race. American Born Chinese is a really powerful graphic novel. It's a story that deals with a very specific character, with Jin, who wishes that he's something that he's not. But it's a story that is extremely universal because it shows the value of becoming comfortable in your own skin with who you are as a person. Reading graphic novels is a really powerful experience. When you're working to decode images as well as words, your brain is working in a totally different way. And it's just as important, it's just as amazing as any other book that you would spend time with and invest yourself in.